Chet getting thirsty again? Pretty sure Chet is always thirsty. It's not so much about getting thirsty again if you're always thirsty already. That's the secret, dude. Man, it's really more travel than you'd imagine. Well, we're thirsty because we're in the desert, guys. Come on. What are you talking about? You're not thirsty? You're really hungry? Oh, no. I'm also pretty hungry, man. I mean, I had crisps, right? Those were those were lunch. <laughs> it's a very good lunch, Chet. I had a protein shake, and then I came home, and I was hungry, but I didn't have a, a lot of time. Oh, I also had a sandwich. Never mind. I also had a sandwich. Never mind. Jean-Paul! I'm coming for you, man! I don't know what I'm looting anymore or why I'm here, but I needed to go here for something. Am I in the right place now? Come on, man. Wait, where am I? No, I'm not in the right place. Dang it. Ooh, shiny, shiny, chat. We didn't go for nothing. Shiny. So it's hard to say... Like, it's hard to see proximity, you know what I mean? On, like, the, the minimap. Because there's a lot of objectives. Jean, Paul, Pierre. Je m'appelle Simon. Oui, oui. La vache, Kiri. Hello. A wife machine? Outsider! There's a lot of wife machines around here, huh? Machine in love. Hello there. Ak! Huh? You came here from Master Jean Paul's village, didn't you? Gosh, she does look cute, though. Look at that. I love the eye patch. I can tell, I can smell him on you. Huh. Okay, that's weird. Jean-Paul is wonderful. He pursues new knowledge with a passion that is almost indescribable. I admire him as I do no other. You have issues. And you clearly lack a discerning eye. I bet men take advantage of you all the time. Not exactly. Ah, right. I found something that Master Jean-Paul is sure to be interested in. Please take it to him with all speed. Why does everyone think I'm an errant boy, chat? Like, what? what is... What, why? So, is there like a hotkey to open the map faster rather than going through this menu? Because I feel like I'm going to have to open the map a lot. Oh, that's also where the lost girl is? Is there, is there, like, can I bind? What does this do? No. Nope. What does this button do? It does nothing? There's a button that does nothing. It's my new favorite button. Mm -mm -mm. It's the opposite of spacebar, yeah.
Okay. <laughs> it's you the button. Sag. Sag indeed, dude. Hey. It's me. Yes. Oh. Circle on the mini map. Circle on the mini map. There's Pascal. There is Sean Paul. We are in France. Nous avons en France. Oui, oui. Sick flex, right? I may have gotten it wrong. Hello? Are you the machine out there looking for a spare part? Oh, nous sommes en France? Ah, oh, fuck, man. I got it wrong. Ah, putain. Je ne parle pas français. There, there you go. Who are you? Your sister asked to look for us. She did? Really? Really? So, what do you say we head home? Wow, I was so scared. Do I have to escort her right now? Oh, don't... Oh, come on now. Don't cry. Did you at least find what you needed? I'm sure she will. But I bet she'll be even happier to see you back home safe and sound. Loco can confirm this is exactly the kind of landscape I see outside my window. That makes sense. No one made the desert. It's just an area that lost all its vegetation due to a lack of precipitation. This caused lasting changes in the soil, which means plants aren't able to... What soil? Soil? Uh, it's dirt. Ground. The stuff we're walking on? <laughs> She's not wrong. Ground is pretty cool. Anyways, I started blasting. Maybe I could talk to these, I'm not sure. Ground is kind of good, man. I agree. I may as well just tape down my RB button, man. And she's a machine as well, so she doesn't really get bothered by the heat so much, right? Wind is just a force caused by changes in temperature and atmospheric pressure and... Huh. That's actually a hard question now that I think about it. Kind of deep, really. I mean, Woo! where does the wind blow from? What do you think, 2B? This don't is know, like Journey. It is. Don't know, don't care. The wind is magic. Nobody knows how the wind works. Oh, shit. Does anyone here know the name of the wind? What's going on, Nebuffet? Thank you so much, man. Ah, uh, it was a King Killer Chrono Control, the reference. I'm rereading the first book right now, which is called the Name of the Wind. Sister, where are you? 
No, not here. Hey, picked up something. Loco, I bought the first book twice, thinking it was the third. Oh no. Um, well, machines can't really make children. Neither can androids, now that I think about it. Aww. Uh, to be? Little help here? Huh? You're the chatty one. Work it out. Oof. Wow, it's getting late. Let's get you home already. Okay, then. Ooh. Oh, God. Okay, we figured out why this person died here. I don't know if she can die. Oh, God. Big boy's kind of scary. Let's go and take care of the little guys first. Always kill the trash first, right? We fought we fought one of these before though. He's like a windmill. Quite exciting. stand here chat we just you know wait a second actually I'm not dealing any damage to him never mind Windmill man, back at it. Now oh, we do do a little bit of damage. Maybe that was 9S, I'm not sure. 9! S. Cool guys, don't look at explosions. I don't run out of ammo, no. Escort quests are always my favorite, guys. Where you just basically follow around something. Oh, I was always a big fan of those in World of Warcraft. Especially when they walked, like, right in between running speed and walking speed. So you could never, like, just follow them around. You always had to, like, manually do so. Because they would run, like... They would walk faster than, than your walking speed, but they would walk way slower than your running... It was confusing and annoying, man. Chat, I just got a pink ribbon. Ooh, baby, can I wear it? Can Grumpy Lady re wear it? <sighs> well, that was exhausting. Yep. Okay, where do children come from? I don't know, man. Um, all items. No, 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 I need like, restored enhancement items? Support items. Where would it be? Is it on a key items? Is it really? Oh! <gasps> Pink ribbon. A trendy pink ribbon with a simple design. Popular amongst androids of all ages. Oh, hell yeah. We look amazing. Uh, can I, uh... I could put a valve on my left eye. 
On both eyes? Or on my head? Fantastic, chat. No! Wait! It... I can't do the... I can't do the ribbon at the same time. I can only have one. Wow, dude. Machine mask? Yeah, no, we had that, that one. That one I'm not a fan of, man. Oh, I was wondering why you guys were posting Gabins in the chat, but it's a Valve. Oh, I see. All right. Yeah, it needs the valve in the neck, exactly. So wait, does this lead to the village? Death. The pink ribbon is a bit too uwu for me. Yeah, it is a bit uwu, I agree. I don't really know exactly what that means, but I understand what you're saying. He was just minding his own business, Loco. Huh. Machines bad, okay? You don't understand, Chet. All machines. Wait, except for the ones in the village. Or the ones we're playing. Or anyone else we decide is cool along the way. And the village people, they're also cool. Why am okay? Wait, no. It's actually not that cool. Shiny. Guys, I am seeing so many shinies. I don't want to flex, but like, there's shinies everywhere. All right, I think we finished the desert area for now. Seems like there's a ton of side quests. Are they all like that? I mean, that wasn't bad. It was, it was okay. I think I'm more interested in the main quest for now. Doesn't seem like they give me anything too interesting so far. Although I like going back to the area. Yeah, I'll do more, but... Might skip a couple. Wait. Isn't that the guy on the roof we just talked to? Huh? Why does it not have a name? Yeah, they all have a story. That's nice. I like that. They're not like, Go fetch me 17 cobalt ears! And then every third cobalt drops one ear. You're like, what? Huh? huh? I literally see them. They're right there. <laughs> Oh, wrong button. Every third is kind of generous, yeah. <laughs> Remember that quest in Goldshire? No, New near Goldshire. It's so detected. painful, man. Yo! Damn, it's swell over a year that I enjoyed your content. Welcome, Cheers, man. mate. Hope the couple primes I dropped during this time are helpful less than three. Now it's been 10 now, man. That's more than three. Ha! <laughs> Thank you very much, dude. Welcome back, Ethnar. Ah, why can I not do it now? It's kind of hard to run on that little... On that little ledge. So it's run, double jump, go across. Oh! Literal god gamer over here, man. Back for more child? Be warned, Father Servo has used your previous gift to make himself stronger. Would you like to test it? Sure. Tell him to get bent? No. This is brown belt already? Oh shit, he's level 30 now, man! What the hell? Did you guys know I actually have a brown belt in judo? I used to do that for many, many years. I haven't in forever. And I think the last time was like when I was like 17. We went from white straight to brown in this game apparently, yeah. 
I would like to get a black belt at some point, but I couldn't yet because I had to like be part of this organization thing of a kick for so for a certain amount of time and it's being a pain in the ass. Level doesn't seem to like mean that much to be honest. But I don't really remember too much of it though. Like I remember a bunch of stuff, but not as much as I probably should. <laughs> I used to do competition and everything too. I mean, I wasn't very good, but... I'm cheesing my opponent? Oh, come on, man! What am I doing wrong this time? You're kind of cheesing your opponent? I'm using the tools that the game gave me! Why am I doing wrong? I'm fighting him while holding down RB! <laughs> I'm not allowed to use RB, I have infinite bullets, why would I not? It's not wrong, it's just kind of cheesy. Uh, I'm using the tools, chat. Maybe I've got easier tools. Kind of like, you know, protals. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. Twin blades all over again? He's the one with the twin blades right there, mate. Wait, are you happy now? Let us discuss the fee. Oh, come on. You're the one who wanted the test. Would you truly refuse a single request from this old monk? Don't even start. Father Servo surrendered all worldly possessions and then took numerous vows. Yet you would deny him a simple request? I mean, if you surrendered all worldly possessions... Uh... What do you want this time, mate? One memory alloy and one broken circuit. The world moves ever on, my child, so do not dwell or... Okay. Target location data obtained. Marking on map. Okay. So those are things I'm gonna have to pick up. That's probably gonna be quite tricky though. Uh, let's go safe. Hello? Oh, sorry. I didn't see you guys. They didn't realize you wanted to die. <laughs> the game, the game's combat feels very satisfying. It's nice. Yeah, it feels very smooth. What are we doing here? We're doing something, chat. Oh, this is for that quest that was literally just started? Guess it's up there. Are you suggesting Loco is a button masher? I mean, I'm not good at fighting games. Oh fuck, Kaladin over here. So wait, now I have to go back again? I think so. Loco, he can't be Kaladin, he's not depressed. 
Kaladin is a bit of a bit of a complainer. Yeah. Man, Brendan Sanderson, what a legend. That guy writes so much and such high quality work. It's so sweet, dude. From what I understand, apparently when he's like tired and he's like got a bit of writer's block or he's just not entirely feeling it, he takes a break and he writes another book. <laughs> so, you know, sometimes he's like, okay, you know what? Life's kind of hard. I'm not really feeling it right now. I don't really want to continue with the main. Let's write another book instead. What a legend. Um, Hold up. Let me just double check real quick if tonight's YouTube video was ready to go. It was, as a matter of fact, not. Because YouTube put weird ad breaks on it. Yeah, the guy churns out books like no tomorrow, man. It's incredibly impressive. It's pretty sweet, though. I'm a fan. Okay. Sorry. I have to all tap out for a second. Um, okay, I gotta go up to the roof again. Uh, I am gonna be heading off pretty soon, yep. Yeah. I mean, I would stay longer, but I know some of you have to, like, go and actually get work done today as well and stuff, you know? So, I'm just being considerate here. I mean, not saying that you guys ever watch the stream while, you know, at, like, I'm not saying that. Uh, where is the, where's the guy again? Oh, he's over there. Loco, I'm just waiting for you to go so I can play near myself. Near, far, wherever you are. <clears throat> My conference call starts in five minutes. Perfect. <laughs> By the way, if you guys are new here, don't forget to hit the follow button. I stream Monday through Saturday, usually between 2 and 8 p.m. Central European time. Have you brought it? I got it, mate. I got all the junk you wanted. Ah, excellent. Now Father Servo can modify himself anew when you return. He will be stronger than ever. Hell yeah. Okay, I'm now a brown belt, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you're impressed. Oh, well, my first action as a brown belt uh, was falling off the roof. Because I was looking at the chat. A superhero fall. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I think I'm gonna go back to the camp, and I will save there. I've done a couple of side quests, a few errands here and there. We should probably save at the camp. Can I, uh... Yeah, I can. Can I... Hello. Can I... Didn't I go through here earlier? Oh. Near automata, wherever you are. <clears throat> Sorry, I'll stop. And I know. Okay, I didn't stop. Uh. Look at that. I feel like after thousands of years. There wouldn't be this much city remaining. Like, I've seen pictures and photos and even videos of, like, what Chernobyl looks like right now. And that basically hasn't been inhabited by humans in, like, a few decades. And it looks like this, basically. Nature's like, ah, oh, thank God, the humans are gone. 
<laughs> Let me grow everywhere. Yeah, maybe I don't know exactly what happens to buildings. I guess a lot of it would disintegrate, but over thousands of years? Life will find a way, 100%. Alrighty. I think there's a good moment to save. I can't, no, I can't do the, I can't do the, the, the bow. I'll go with a valve on top of my head. So I can make Gaben proud. Okay, I don't like the valve on top of my head. Sorry, Gaben. Uh, retro gray pod? Cardboard pod? Machine Vossel. No, no, no. These are just... We'll do one in our left eye. Hell yeah. That's pretty cute. Alrighty, guys. Welcome back into the world of Nier Automata. I'm still at the very beginning of the game. I mean, not at the very, very beginning. I've played for, I don't know, five hours, maybe? Is that all I got? I did have to restart the introduction of the game once because I died. And apparently it does not save. <laughs> Which is a little bit crazy. Either way, uh, this seems to be like an open world JRPG type of game. It's a little... I'm not entirely sure in what category to put this, but it's like open world-ish. I don't know. Anyways, let us go ahead and continue with the main quest, which is right over here. Say, Anamone, I've got a package for you from a machine called Pascal. A fuel filter? Ah, perfect timing. We're running low. Wait, you met Pascal? Sure. Did you know you've been consorting, or so you've been consorting with machines, huh? Just the, oh, no, just the ones in the village. They're totally harmless, and they also have the means to construct intricate devices that we can. In exchange, we provide them with oil and other materials. I guess you'd call it a form of commerce. All right. Anyway, if you're headed back there, please take this high fissos or fiss. I'm just not even gonna try. Oil to Pascal. All right, I've got some viscous oil. Very nice. I don't know. I've got a valve on my eye. I'm not sure. I'm just trying to make Gaben happy, I guess. Yeah, apparently there's like loads of endings for this game. I already had one. AKA I died in the tutorial. Uh, there's also a side quest I can pick up over here. Ah, so you're the new Yorha models, aren't you? I guess we are the newest, now that you mention it. Did you need something? I bet new models like you can handle pretty much anything. Right. Sure, listen to her problem. Why don't you tell us what's wrong? It turns out one of my friends has gone missing. Where was this friend last seen? At the ma material storage site where he works. Alright. I will try and find him. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Okay, so he can be anywhere in the red area. Which is quite a lot. Well, I mean, there's a red icon right over there on the mini map. So I guess it's. I can't go there because of the camera in this game, but. Bitrate is pretty fucked on my end. Anyone else suffering? Um, I'm not noticing any problems on my end. Let me know if there's any issues for anyone. Does it look bad? It shouldn't look bad, but... Why can't I stop thinking about it? Stop thinking about what? Yeah, what? Who are you? Where would you are, huh? Anamone told us to make ourselves at home. Right, so what can you stop thinking about? One of my friends has a box that makes music when you open it, and I can't get the damn song out of my head. It's just so beautiful. I've never heard anything like it. To make it worse, I can only remember the first part of the song. It's driving me nuts. I wish she'd come back to the camp so I could hear the damn thing. Do I just accept every single side quest, guys? 
The item in question is likely a music box. It should be located in an area where music is playing. The local amusement park would be a logical area. Alright. I just keep accepting side quest after side quest. Yo, what's going on, Thor? How are you doing, buddy? Thor, you just missed some phenomenal games of Zerk vs. Protoss, dude. Where my opponent made, like, Void Rays and then Carriers. And as you may have guessed, I lost to them. And then I got frustrated and now we're playing near Automata. Because, like... Uh, that's my feeling, dude. That's how I feel currently. Oh. Well, what do you think? <laughs> he just started transmitting to us directly. Now do you believe we're not a threat? Your mouth can say anything it wants, but you still don't have a heart. I suppose that's technically accurate. Wait, we have hearts as androids? Well, you're free to visit our village whenever you like. Aww. Sweet. Okay, let me go ahead and save real quick. And then we'll go from there. I might not bother do all, doing all side quests now. But I mean, I'm doing a bunch. May as well, right? I know some people get upset if I don't do literally every single thing, but I'm gonna have to disappoint you guys because I'll probably not do literally every single thing. <laughs> Yo, have a good one, Shinobu. Take care. So there's a lot of quests that I can do. Um, do I... Uh, oh, I can make a marker like that. Okay. So I think that marker will probably make it a bit easier to navigate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Loco will make it up to us by playing this game three times over. I think, chat, that I'm gonna do one finishing of this game. Which I know a lot of you will probably not consider me finishing this game. I think there's like a dozen... Uh, dozens of endings, right? There's a lot of different ones. But maybe. Maybe I'll change my mind. Who knows? I have a never-ending list of games to play, guys. If I if I play the same game over and over and over again, like for example, StarCraft II, like imagine that. It's crazy. Yeah, dude, we got an insane amount of subs already today, Thor. Despite me getting salty. Actually, no, that was before me getting salty. Never mind. New subscriber detected. Yo. A Garing Dutch. Thank you very much. That was because I got salty, right? Yeah, you got to your work computer. Oh, I see how it is. Thank you very much, Garing. Milo needs this. Milo actually has got some new food, dude. Okay, real quick, right? First off, thank you again, Nagaring, like for the insane generosity. That's a that's a lot of subs. Thank you, dude. Um, I was doing a little bit of research the other day. When it comes to different types of cat food. Now, one thing I learned is that nobody agrees on anything when it comes to cat food whatsoever. It is um pretty much impossible to get a consensus on what is good. And what isn't. Now, I came across this website that apparently compared, like, I think it was like 280 different cat foods on purity and quality and everything. So, we changed to a different brand, which I'm currently, like, mixing in with his regular things that he was eating earlier. Anyways, it's a little bit more expensive, Agaring. And you said this, you know, these 20 subs were for, or for Milo, so there you go. No, the internet does not agree on something. I know. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. <laughs> I didn't know what I expected either. But turns out the internet does not agree on everything. Huh. Plus, um, obviously we're getting the other cat in a couple weeks time. Um, the, uh, the new kibble that he's got is also fine for kittens. So it'll, it'll work out. But, bro, like, I came across a couple of, like, cat forums and, like, a couple of cat Facebook pages. And I swear to God that people treat those cats way better than they treat themselves. 
Like, they, they will treat those cats so much better than they treat their own bodies. It's insane. <laughs> They're like, no, no, no. I can't feed this to my cat. It only has 85% meat, and he needs at least 90. It's like, but, like, you probably, you know, get most of your protein from chicken nuggets, right? Like, <laughs> anyway, <laughs> anyways. I thought it was kind of funny. But, uh, yeah, we did, we did go for some... Some better food, or at least technically better food. Hey, are you guys friendly? Guys, they're not friendly. Don't worry. I swung my anime sword. Now they're dead. He seems to love it though, man. So like we bought like this, this other brand that we've never had before. Which is supposed to be like, it's like no grain and like very high protein and the whole shebang, right? Proper sources of meat as well, so like not like trashy, cheapest shit you can find. Anyways, the first day we gave it to him, it was mixed through his regular food. <sighs> this bastard would literally spend like a half hour looking at his food and only picking out the new ones. So he was like very carefully dodging all of his old, like his old kibble and just eating the fresh stuff. That was, like, new. He took a long time. He's eating. I was like, oh my god, he's loving it. And then I realized, wait a second, he's taking a really long time. What's going on? Anyways. I guess he thought we put treats in the middle of his regular meal. He's like, you know what? Let me... Let me fish those out. <laughs> Sounds like something a cat would do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey! Hey, is this the bridge? That we started at? I think it might just be. Oh shit, dude. I didn't realize. <gasps> Is that the sword I had at the beginning of the game? Ooh, yes. Virtuous Treaty. Very nice. I'm going to equip it. Even though it might not be better than my current weapon, it has the word virtuous in it, and it looks badass. What's more important, stats or aesthetics? Oh, wow. Whoa! Whoa! I just looted so much shit! Was that my old body? Aesthetics are way more important, right? Also, by the way, guys, compliments for all of the variety in the word aesthetics and the spelling of it. <laughs> Very nice. I'm seeing at least five dozen. Okay, not five dozen. I've seen like half dozen different spellings of the word. <laughs> it is A-S-S-T-E-T-I-C-S. -S Ass tactics. Yes. There it is. Uh, yeah. I didn't realize that we could actually go back to the tutorial area, though. Why do we find copper ore in a random place? Uh, is this even where we want to go, by the way? Yeah, I guess so. See, I'm a little scared I'm accidentally going to run into a place that is much higher level than me. I don't know if that's a real concern. Is this where we were? Oh, shit. Kill him dead. Gun him down. I am speed, though. I am so fast. Yeah, yeah, this is the exact prologue area. Huh. Hey. Hold up, there's something to loot, isn't there? What? Am I winning? Ow.
Oh, I don't like this angle for fighting, man. Like this angle is kind of hard to, like this top-down view. It's kind of hard to judge how well I'm doing. I guess the things I saw over there were uh, <laughs> enemies I was walking into. Uh, this game is called Near Automata. Don't ask me why it's called that. I have no idea. It's been a lot of fun so far, though. Very different than what I normally play. It reminds me, in a in a way, a little bit of like Dark Souls, but not really. Hey, would you look at that? Nine S actually doing something for once. I don't even know if I'm going the right way, guys. I feel like I'm not. <laughs> what if I'm just completely going the wrong way? Hello, can I get back to the ground, please? Okay, he showed us his back. Shouldn't have done that. Does it matter, Loco? I mean, it does a little. I don't like going places for no reason, but I also am too lazy to open up the mini map. Okay, fine. I'll open up the big map then. I'm a little lazy to open up the big map. Yeah, there is something here. There's like multiple things here, it seems. So I guess I'm going the right way. There's a lot of these chests that I cannot, like, open. I think I need, like, another ability or something for that. The only problem is when you die in this game, you have to go all the way back to, like, your latest, like, vending machine or whatever you want to call it. New hey, thank you, Anonymous. Did. I mean, Thort. Ah, I mean, Anonymous. A thousand G's right there on the ground? In a chest? If I find something in a chest, it's mine, right? I have to go down, though, don't I? Man, I find the map extremely difficult to navigate, though. Like, I have to look for those red dots. How do I go? Like, is this even... No. I don't think that was the one I was even hunting for earlier. I don't know. I guess we just run around. No, I've been over here. Uh. Ooh, there you go. Does anyone happen to know if I'm going in a direction that will actually help me out? Because uh, I feel like I'm wasting my time now. I am going in a direction that will help me out? Okay. Maybe I should have just followed the main quest. So this will eventually go down, doesn't it? Or isn't it? Can I... Can I jump on that? No, oh, I can't. Is there a place to get on? Yeah. No, oh, I can't jump over it. No, no place to get on. Yeah, go ahead, Heldy. I recognize some of these parts, though, from, like, the prologue, because we ran that twice. Yeah, and some of the chests I've already looted, I guess. So now I'm going down. Rusted clump. Was that something I needed? If you look at the map in the dark gray area, that is where you can go. 
Oh, you mean the map that isn't dark gray. Right, 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 right. Okay. Yeah, yeah, sorry. So this is where I was, Chet. This is, like, where I, I came from. I guess I took a wrong turn somewhere. There was this one area where I could go two directions, but I don't remember where I was. Maybe it is this way? I don't remember which one I took. Oh, I can't. It's, uh... It's not something I can interact with currently. Yeah, this is where we started. Hmm. All right, well, you know what? We'll go somewhere else, I guess. What's going on, Muck? How are you doing, buddy? Oh. My game just turned black, but I can still see it in my OBS. Oh, it's back. Okay, that was weird. I took a wrong turn somewhere. Yeah, I'm sure I did. That makes sense, because I, uh, I didn't get where I wanted to go, but it's fine. Dude, yeah, we've had an insane amount of subs today, Muktifus. It's September, man. 20% off gifted subs this month. But I still get the full amount, which is pretty cool. Uh, there is fall damage in this game, yeah, but I can, like... Go like this. Wait, I thought I couldn't go in the dark gray area. I can't. Yeah. New subscriber. You think I should go in there? Alright, fine. I'll go all the way back then. But I don't know where. Hey, thank you, Muck. <laughs> Appreciate it, man. New Gifting the five subs. Detected. Okay, yeah, I shouldn't go there. Okay, detected. fine. I won't then. Why is it announcing every single sub separately? What is this? Why is this new? New subscriber <laughs> detected. I don't know why it's doing this randomly now. It's decided that it's once again gonna announce every single sub individually. I'm not sure as to why or how or what happened there. New subscriber But hey, there you go. Detected. You all get maximum maximum recognition it comes from the heart oh thank you muck new subscriber well this is the way it used to always do it and then i changed it so it would always announce it like as like you know one notification but anyways all right uh so where do we go then i guess i'm gonna run in the direction of the main quest that one will take me back to the village. Basically, the current quests, they took me from one side of the map to the village, and then back to the camp, New and then from the camp, detected. we have to go back to the village. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's the game trying to tell me that I should do some side quests. We'll go down to the village. Hey, thank you, Echo, as well, actually, for gifting us up to Echo Storm. Oh, no, Shadow Storm. Sorry. I was going to say, that would explain the sub. If someone wants this Echo in the name. Yeah, we have been to the village. There's all kinds of lovely robots there. And great music, too. Is there... Oh, uh, that's where the judo guy is at. That's where Jackass is at with that difficult one. I don't really want to go there. Um, Jean-Paul's Melancholy. Yeah, we did actually finish that one. Wait, I have to go to... Hmm. 
Oh, we can actually mark them on the map like that too. You know what? Maybe I should go and do that one. Because I think that one probably ends in the village. Because Jean-Paul is in the village. Yeah, I'm kind of feeling the same way, ain't you? It is a little bit difficult to navigate. But mostly because like there's certain areas where you feel like you can go through. Like, for example, I don't know, this area or whatever. Like, there's oftentimes these big hallways where you feel like you can run in and your character just kind of walks at the wall. I think it takes a little bit of getting used to. New subscriber detected. Okay, so we've been in here already. Shinies? Thank you, Echo, for gifting a sub to Echo Arts. That makes sense. You found someone whose name is Echo? Oh, were they watching the stream? Or is it just a random person that had Echo in their name? <laughs> not that I'm saying, I'm not judging, I'm just saying, like... Just curious. They were not watching the stream, they were just a random person with the name Echo? They just got an email notification, Echo Arts that is, that he got subscribed to Loco TV. He's like, what? Who's that? I haven't been on Twitch in years. <laughs> That's how we get one new viewer at a time. 